Shalom, it's the Lemon Eddie back with another video. You should let them know you also saw the title. Yes, my name is Eddie. I'm African American and I am moving to the city of Cairo in the country of Egypt. Now, Cairo is a really big city, so in particular, I'm moving to a gated city called Medinity, which in, Air, which in English translates to my city. Some Egyptian billionaire went ahead and built his own city with like grocery stores and malls and all kind of stuff and that's where I'm going to be moving and so you guys are going to spend my, basically my last 24 hours here I'm going to go buy a bus ticket I'm going to buy some itemry I'm going to just go get some food do all this type of stuff you guys want to hang out with me for the day the first stop of today is the ATM we live in a financial world guys we live in a financial world traveling costs money living costs money it's about everything man everything costs money and so we're, money is a fickle mistress in the fact that Whoever pays it the most attention, that's who it flocks to. So pay attention to your money, guys. But anyway, we're going up to the ATM, get some cash out, then we're gonna um, buy a couple of stuff at the mall. All right, so the ATM that I normally go to um, is this one right there called QMB. That ATM is out of service, so I already have some cash on me. I'm gonna go buy some headphones, actually. Um, I wanna go buy some headphones. So I'm just at the mall right now, though. So. I already live in Egypt, if this is your first time watching my video, I live in Egypt already, um, but I live in like the lower portion of Egypt, low-key kind of close to Sudan, I need to get out of here. <laughs> but I'm going to be heading up now to a new city uh, in Cairo. The city that I live in now is kind of a smaller city, more of a low-key city. I never say the name of the city. Why? Because I don't want too many people coming here. It's like a hidden gem. You know, I like to keep it preserved, keep it quiet. But I never tell the name of this city. But yeah, so I'm going to be heading up to Cairo. Um, in particular, Medinity. Medinity is already a known city. It's a big city. Uh, millions and millions and millions of people live in Cairo already, so it's no big thing to mention to that mention that city to you guys. So, um, the reason why I don't own headphones already is because I don't listen to music at all. Um, if I'm like in a store right now, like how I am now, and the music happens to come on, sure, I'll listen to it. I'm not gonna like run out of the store like, oh my gosh, music. But, um, I don't know, is, is this coming with the thing? Let me see how much these are. Let's see how much those are. I don't know if it comes with the USB C thing or not. Um, alright, so these are 100 pounds, which is probably like uh, three bucks, but they don't have, you know, you know, these new phones and all this retarded stuff. So I need to have like the headset that has it looks like this, but for USB C. Um, but I actually have a USB C cord at my house, so this right here should work for me. All right, so I'm actually gonna take these two up there to the counter and see which one is actually gonna be cheaper. Um, I feel like this plastic one will be, but we'll find out right now. Thank you. So you might be wondering, okay, if you don't listen to music, oh, an ATM downstairs wasn't working, like I said. So, but if you're like, if you don't listen to music, why are you buying headphones? So, there's a book, it's called Psycho Cybernetics, and there's an audio program for that. The bus ride from where I am now to Cairo is around seven hours. And so I need something to occupy my mind during those seven hours, and I'm going to be listening to that audiobook. I don't when I listen to like videos and stuff like that, I just play it out loud on my speaker. Um, but because I'm on a bus and all this type of stuff, I'd rather have my own pair of headphones to uh, be able to listen to the video that I'm watching. Um, in this case, it's going to be an audiobook, and it's about um, how to identify your self-image and how to improve your self-image to get more of what you want out of life. So yeah, psycho cybernetics. I'm going to be listening to that book on my ride there today i'm really just coming to buy my ticket i'm gonna leave out tomorrow morning at around like 10 a.m so today is about buying the go bus ticket they have um an online website but you actually cannot buy tickets online there's some type of fault within the system at this moment in time where there's some type of fault in the system at this moment in time where when you try to buy a ticket online it doesn't actually go through so um yeah, that's why I have to keep coming up to the station to buy it. But um, it's kind of crowded in here today, actually. But let's see what I can do. Hello. Uh, I want to buy a ticket to Modernity. 
No, tomorrow. Hey, I'm gonna do scene number 12. 12. Okay, I'm gonna do scene 12. Alright, so 310 pounds, how much the ticket is? It's like 10 US dollars. Okay. Um, so I got the ticket in my hand now, we're pretty much finished. So, what I'm gonna do now... Oh, I need a thumbnail. I need a thumbnail for today's video. So I'm gonna see if I can go in the back and take a thumbnail real quick. Um, hold on. These are like the buses that, they, that they'll travel you on. The last one I did was a, a Business Elite M. That was a really nice bus, really clean bus. Um, like it was like the first class bus. It was the most expensive one that I can buy. This one, because I'm going into the city of Modernity itself, I can't take a nice one um, like one of these. I'm taking like a micro bus, a mini bus. But I don't mind that because the, the station, the Tahir station in Cairo, old Cairo is freaking disgusting. So I would never put myself in that situation again to go to Tahir station. So I want to go straight into Medinity, get into the nice area with a, with a, with a cool bus. I don't, know, I don't know what bus, I don't know what the bus will look like on the inside per se. So I'm going to document that and film that for you guys. But I do know that I would not go to Tahir station again. If you come to Egypt and you take on a go bus, do not go to Tahir station, all right? Anyway, let's head to the marina to get some food. Um, and I guess we got a little bit more about my last 24 hours here. Yo, so look how amped up the traffic is right now, bro. Like, you can't even really go nowhere. This guy's trying to reverse out. Michael Bus is coming. They honking. I'm just trying to go across the street to go show you this park. And this is like how hectic it is. Michael Bus pull up on you just like this. It's kind of crazy. But anyway, I'm gonna try to go across the street. I'm gonna try to go across the street right real quick. I've never actually came here and hung out here before, guys. Believe it or not. So they got like a nice seating areas. This is maybe one of the only parks that I've ever seen. Um, but I don't come on the street. I don't like the street. It's too crowded. It's too hectic. So I guess they have like a little kids uh, park right here. And I guess the gym is maybe behind it. Yeah, so they uh, have also like restaurants in this area as well. So it's like a real like community park. And it's in the middle of two lanes. So there's a lane on the right side and a lane on the left side. It is kind of loud within this area. I'm not going to kid you. But it's nice. It seems like a cool area. Now this right here I want to show you guys. It looks like a really nice modern apartment. Something like you would see, you know, um, in a regular area, you know. And then one thing I want to tell you like this as well. They love putting Apple logos on stuff. I don't know why. Alright, right now we're here at the marina. I mean, I've been here for a while. I never show you guys the marina. There's a lot of places that I don't actually ever show on camera throughout the city. But I'll get out here and show you guys. So, a lot of restaurants and bars um, over here on um, this left side. Lined up with palm trees. And of course, I'm going to show you guys the boats and stuff like that as well. Um... So, hello, how you doing? How you doing? Um, they uh, always have, um, they always have, let me show you guys. So, turn right here. Got like, all kind of boats, yachts, stuff like that. Really nice, really nice blue water. And you can see as it get farther out. I switch like that. But anyway. So yeah, these right here are ashtrays up top and then trash cans down below. And they'll be on these stands like this. And they have them kind of positioned everywhere. So this one don't have that many boats in here. This one got a small amount. All these ones are taken out already. 
pharmacy off in that corner, apartments, they're all hotels really get above up here. So I'm here at this Greek restaurant today. I've been eating here pretty much every single day for the last few days into my, until I leave out uh, tomorrow. Today, this is new. See the table set, have like a fake flower. Uh, little blue thing to the tablecloth. So this, it's a Greek restaurant, so that the color scheme is like white, blue, you know, gray. So they always have ashtrays, um, pretty much everywhere you go. All right, so basically, guys, we're finished now. We're gonna head out. All right, guys, that's gonna actually conclude my video for today. Um, I think I said in the beginning, but my name is Nolan Eddie. I'm a 23-year-old American who lives abroad full-time. On my channel, I talk about travel, business, and all around us, how to be a good person. If you think that's interesting to you, then subscribe to my channel. Other than that, I'll see you guys in the next one. Y'all willing. Shalom.